So extremely hot. We are completely parched. <laughs> Hello, and we are in Armenia, in the capital, Yerevan. And Armenia is also called the land of apricot. And uh, we have maybe 12 hours here today and I'm taking you along. It's beautiful and it's extremely hot. It's around 35 degrees Celsius. So extremely hot. We are completely parched. <laughs> and uh, there are small coffee shops on every corner. It seems that uh, Armenian people love their coffees, different coffees, frappuccinos, smoothies. They are literally on every street corner. And we are going to go and try some. And Armenian language is actually one of a kind. It doesn't belong to any language group. It's one on, one on its own. So it doesn't belong to Georgia. It doesn't belong to any Eastern languages or Turkish. But you can see here a mixture of uh, Georgia, Turkey, and the special, specific Armenian vibe. Armenia is the cradle of Christianity in Europe. Armenia was the first country who introduced Christianity. They uh, became Christian was around 300 after Christ uh, and there are churches and uh, Christian remnants everywhere. It's uh, the mother of Christianity here in Europe so it's extremely interesting. And we were just at the Vernissage which had all the Armenian craft and uh, we bought our one souvenir, which is a coffee pot with an Armenian king made out of copper. It's beautiful. Cream cheese latte and dolce glass. The prices are it's cheaper than in Poland. Everything seems much cheaper than in Poland. <laughs> the currency here is dram and these cost around... The coffee prices range from two to four dollars. We are going to the food market, gum market, which has specialties or Armenian food specialities and it's scorching hot the UV rays are over the limits they checked here the UV radiation
pomegranate juice, local sweets. Wine leaves, different pickles. The heat is unbearable and we're trying to find something to eat. Uh, it's difficult when you're new in town. We only saw pizza and burgers. Would like to try something else. We are very tired. It's around 3 p.m. We are exhausted. We've been walking around for like two hours. And now we just want to eat anything, even pizza and burgers. We just wanted something else than pizza that we saw, but it's extremely hot and uh, there's no food. There's only cafes everywhere, like with coffees and pastries, but we need something substantial. So whew, it's um, at the point of complete exhaustion now. So behind me you can see the cascades which are cold like that because of the running water and apparently if you climb on top you can maybe see Mount Ararat where Noah stranded but we are not going to climb up there we are too tired completely completely tired 7 p.m. and it's maybe 32 degrees Celsius <laughs> and uh, as you saw we finally found a food court there are a lot of food courts we ate some mixture of European Asian and Armenian food I had some rice with meat <laughs> but we're going to go to the supermarket buy some Armenian things now to eat for our supper and uh, it's been a wonderful day. We arrived uh, today, this morning, in Yerevan, in Armenia. And tomorrow we are probably going to see Mount Ararat to go on a trip. But if you want to see that, maybe I will film a little short clip for my membership. And today you can summarize this day as a day of coffee shops, doing thousands of steps of uh, extreme heat and uh, some Armenian culture. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, hit that notification bell and I will see you in my next video.